is up. Tyler here with TarverAcademy.com. I want to give a big thank you to Learning Bird for sponsoring this post. Check them out. Okay, so we're looking at independent and dependent variables. So independent, that's not a, and dependent. Huh. Ha! Best spelling ever. Such good penmanship. That's why I'm not a doctor. Actually, that's a lot, of, a lot of doctors write, so maybe I should be a doctor. Am I a doctor? I don't know. I'm good with Neosporin. Okay, so we're looking at independent and dependent variables, okay? Whenever you have an equation, usually, especially a word problem, um, you're going to deal with things called independent and dependent variables, okay? Independent. An independent variable is exactly what it sounds like. It's independent. It stands independent of anything else, okay? A lot of times, someone's age, um, some, something that's set, um, if you are, are purchasing something, the amount you want to buy, these are independent of anything else because you control them. They're controlled. They're what you decide that goes in there, okay? You don't get to pick, oh, I'm going to multiply this to get my age. No, you don't. You are a certain age. It's independent of anything else, okay? That's an independent variable. Stands alone. Okay? Dependent variable is exactly what it sounds like. Dependent. That means it depends on something else. Okay? How much money you spend at the store depends on how much stuff you buy. Um, how old your dog is in dog years depends on how many years old they are in human years. Okay? The dependent variable depends on whatever you're putting in for the independent variable. Okay? It depends on your situation. Okay? So, um, dependent, it uh, depends. Okay? Now, um, your independent variable will be called a lot of things. It will be called your input. Um, this is called your output. Dependent will be called your output. Um, independent is also your x. Dependent is your y. Whenever you're drawing a graph, your independent goes on bottom okay your dependent goes on the side that's because you would control this and then this would always fluctuate depending on what your independent value is okay so let's look at a real quick example of independent dependent values okay let's have a situation say i want to go buy some hats I'm, i want to go lids and i want to buy a bunch of cool hats okay braves hats that's what's up okay be some flat bills maybe some snapbacks um, so I want to buy some hats. Every hat at Lids is on sale for $16. That's a good number. $16, okay? Now, I know, what do I control? Do I control the sale going on at Lids? No, I don't. I do control how many hats I want to buy. Let's say I want to buy four hats, okay? I want to buy four hats. They're $16 each. And then I want to know how much money I'm going to spend, okay? To make our equation, we know it would be our amount of hats we're buying times $16, and that's going to equal our money, okay? So much money we're going to spend. Do I control the amount of money that I'm going to spend? Not really, no. The amount of money I'm going to spend depends on how many hats I want to buy. I control the purchase of the hats. Lids controls the amount of money that that's going to end up being. So our independent variable is our X, which is our amount of hats we're buying. Dependent, the price depends on how many hats I'm buying. Okay? So almost all the time in your equations, whatever you're playing in for X, your starting thing, the put your thing you're putting into the problem, that is going to be your, your input. That is going to be your independent variable because you're putting it in there. You're placing that in there. You control it. It's independent. Doesn't matter what else, the, whatever the problem says, doesn't matter. Okay? Dependent is your answer. Most of the time, it's your answer. It's what you get as an outcome. It's what, when you throw the input in, you hit, hit it with numbers, add it, subtract it, multiply it, blah, 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 blah. Whatever you get, that's your dependent. Okay? It depends on whatever you put in there. Independence what you toss in, dependence what you get out. Okay? Independent, dependent variables. I feel like you just learned something today, ladies and gentlemen. It's a good day to learn. Thank you again, Learning Bird, for sponsoring this post. Thank you for learning. I also want to thank 
for watching this video. You're the best. Check out TorfairAcademy.com. Peace! Hey, Tyler here. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out tarveracademy.com.